ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another video i know it's i've been waiting to get something new into this this time we've got fs2 crew for the unity summer 3. um it's not about its first update so i hope it works um well um yeah so let's go ahead and get started today's flight will take us from uh oh here over from manchester over to um athens Flight time is about two, sorry, three hours and twenty. Fairly long flight. Well, let's go ahead and get started. Let's start setting up. Roger. I'll do my flows. On circuit breakers, effect emergency equipment. The uh, the sun visor is installed. Good. That's all everything's good. Circle pressure checked, sun visor installed, the equipment checked. New here. Engine oil quantities, solid quantities, speed break down, flaps up indicating. Fake test works. Break set. Perfect. Um, just got to check one thing while, while I was up here. Pins installed in the stores closed. The annual gear extension book. Recall. Verify the indications and then cancel them. Our, our weather. Nine or nine or six. That all three. It's checked. We shall continue. In the meantime, uh, fueling is also commencing. Got fueling loading. 737-800, uh, database is up to date. Anything is checked. EMT and date is checked. I'm out for the walk around. Runway two three left. That number is neutral alpha. The departure. The departure two three left. Sambi one Yankee or Samba one Yankee. The arrival when the B ILS. Zulu zero three left. Clerks. Papa. Berkey. Okay, yeah. Rooting is checked, so activate execute. Go to alternate destination. Plug in the alternate. Put a performance in it. Also next to 73. Our expected zero fuel weight is 59.8. Fuel is 12 point. Our initial cruise level is. 330 86 at 45 4 and transition altitude is 5000 feet all right so fixed information is set and forecast transition level in Athens is 100 or 100 for progress page, verify the routing distance 1558. The flight plan says 1549er, which is fine. Uh, we still have the approach and everything in there. And then an extra fuel of 3.8 is planned, or not planned, but what the AFMC calculates, and we plan with 3.4 tons. So that checks out as well. The FMC is set. All right, we'll continue with the pre-flight flows. First light test. The climb is 5,000 feet. Initial heading is 232. 
I'm back. No issues on the walk around. Things are normal, everything is connected here. Hi, Molly. Hello. Light slow. Pull up. Wind shear. Wind shear. Wind shear. Terrain. Terrain. Questions? Pull up. No questions. Pre flight checklist. Pre flight checklist. Oxygen. I said 100%. Tested 100%. Navigation transfer and display switches. Normal auto. Windows heat. On. Pressurization mode selector. Auto. Flight instruments. Heading 315. Altimeter 996. Heading 315. Altimeter 996. Parking brake. Set. Engine start levers. Cut off. Pre-flight checklist completed. Hi guys, here's the load sheet for you. Thanks. No problem, have a safe flight. Alright, so we got the load sheet, we're gonna update our values. Let's set. All our final reserves are 2.8. Execute. N1 limit. Done a takeoff calculation here. We're doing the rate of thrust takeoff 1. No assumed temperature because of the rain. And we're going to take off of flaps 5. This is checked as well. V V1, we've got 136, 146, and 150. Go here. set. Are we clear to close? Yes. Thanks. Let me know if you need anything. Before start checklist. Before start checklist. Flight deck door closed and locked. MCP. V2150 heading 232 altitude 5000. Takeoff speeds. V1135 VR147 V2150. B2150. CDU preflight. Completed. Rudder and aileron trim. Pre and zero. Taxi and takeoff briefing. Completed. Anti collision light. On. Before star checklist completed. Earth sequence is two, then one. Check. You're ready for pushback and engine start. Roger. Release the parking brakes, please. Brakes Hi, released. Pushing back. You are clear behind, and you can start your engines at your discretion. Turn engine two. Starting engine two. Oil pressure. Starter cutout. Brakes are set. Roger. Okay, the tow bar is disconnected Number and the equipment stable. is clear. 
Or engine one. Starting engine one. Oil pressure. to disconnect. Number one, stable. Thanks. Have a good flight. See you later. Laps five. Laps five. Engine anti-ice coming on. Control check. Pull up. Pull down. Pull left. Pull right. Left. Alright. Light controls check complete. Before taxi checklist. Before taxi checklist. Generators on. Probe heat on. Anti ice. Engine anti ice is on. Isolation valve auto. Engine start switches. Continuous. Recall. Checked. Checked. Auto brake. RTO. Engine start levers. Idle detent. Flight controls. Checked. Ground equipment. Clear. Clear. Before taxi checklist completed. Go left. Clear right. Entry procedure. Runway entry procedure. Runway entry procedure. Okay. Cabin crew, take your seats. Clear on the approach. Ready to go. Take off. Thrust set. Knots. Right. V1. V1. Rotate. Positive rate. You're up. You're up. One. Speed checked. Flaps one set. Thumbs up. Speed checked.
Flaps upset. After takeoff checklist. After takeoff checklist. Engine bleeds. On. Packs. Auto. Landing gear. Up and off. Flaps. Up. No lights. After takeoff checklist complete. Gear down, flaps 15. Speed checked, gear down. Cleared. Flaps 15, set. Flaps 25. Speed checked. Flaps 30. Flaps 25, set. Speed checked. Any checklist. Flaps 30 set. Any checklist. Landing checklist. Landing checklist. Landing checklist.
Landing checklist. That and checked. Double check that, please. Landing checklist. Speed brake. Arm. Landing gear. Down. Flaps. 30. 30 green light. Landing checklist completed. Approaching minimums. Approaching minimums. 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 Continue. 100. 50. 30. 20. 10. Speed break up. Reverser is normal. Sixty knots. Okay to clean up. Roger. Lights and doors. Check. Cabin crew disarm doors and cross check. Three minutes. Shut down checklist. Shut down checklist. Fuel pumps off. Probe requested. heat off. Hydraulic panel set. Flaps up. Parking brake set. Engine start levers cut off. Weather radar off. Off. Shut down checklist completed. Well guys, that is the end of this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's flight uh, with a little bit of FS crew. Um, if you guys want me to do a tutorial or whatever the case may be, let me know. Um, yeah. <laughs> nice to have FS crew and MS, uh, MSFS, um, but unfortunately I'm not very happy with it again. Um, it's basically the PCD version, which was not really good in my opinion for the PMDT. Um, Lots of things to improve, and I wish FS crew, this is my biggest complaint, I wish FS crew was more dynamic. What I mean by that is that you're not stuck with those 25 minutes that, you know, if you can't board right now, then say, no, we can't board, and she'll ask you in 5 minutes again, and your pre-flight basically is extended by 5 minutes. That's a good example. Um, or, or the time is held um, as a standstill for now. Though you say boarding is now 
able to be commenced, and that's when the time continues to go down. Or things, uh, simple things like um, actually knowing what position the, you know, uh, the ground equipment is in. Because if you request the ground power unit, but the ground power unit is already connected, he's gonna think it's not connected and then connected. But by pressing connect, he's actually disconnecting it again. You know what I mean? And uh, like have the recognition. I know the SDK should be able to. You know they should have to read the SDK, and I'm not sure how well written the SDK is. But being able to recognize what position a switch is in or the ground equipment is very helpful. I've noticed that also a lot of the procedures aren't 100% accurate to what Boeing manual says, so SOP 1. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm actually even thinking about not using a FIS crew for the future, um, at least for this airplane. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll see you on the next video. Until then, peace.